Hey guys, what is up? It's Anna. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I've seen this video kind of floating around YouTube where they go to their local Starbucks and they try out the entire fall menu. So that is what I'm going to try today. But I have never ever tried fall drinks from like Dunkin or Starbucks or any place that has like pumpkin flavored coffee, I guess. So we're going to have a little fun today. We're going to go play around and try something new. So let's go ahead and head to Starbucks. pumpkin flavored treats and drinks and everything. So I'm really excited to start this off. I think I'm gonna kick it off with the pumpkin spice latte just because that's the original. That's like the typical fall drink. I think this one's it. It doesn't have a little sticker on it, but all the other ones do. So I'm assuming that this is the pumpkin spice latte. I know all of these drinks you can either get hot iced or frozen. So I wanted to do like a variety. So I got two hot drinks, one frozen and one iced. spice latte hmm. I'm definitely going to be bouncing off the walls after this video because all of these have caffeine in them I really like this one definitely going to finish this why have I never had this before now I'm wishing I got a bigger size but mm. okay yum I am gonna give this one a 10 out of 10. Really like it. It's the original, the OG. This next thing that I have here is ice. So this one is a tall pumpkin cream cold brew. Now, I don't really know if I like cold brew. Like I said, I love coffee, but cold brew is like super, super strong. So I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one, but we're gonna give it a go. That is not strong at all. That tastes like iced coffee. Why did I feel like this was gonna be way stronger? This is really good too. Okay, well, we're off to a really good start. Definitely gonna be bouncing off the walls. This is gonna make me go absolutely insane. So I'm sorry to whoever has to communicate with me a little bit later. This one is really good. Starbucks is killing it so far. I'm going to give this one a nine and a half out of 10 because I still like, I think I still like the pumpkin spice latte a little teeny, teeny bit better. But if I wanted something ice, I would definitely go for this one. I feel like I'm gonna be finishing these all, which I definitely didn't expect. that I have here. This one's a little bit melted, but that's okay. So this one is the salted caramel mocha frappuccino. I'm not a huge fan of frappuccinos. I don't really go for them. I'd rather have like coffee or, you know, if I'm going to Starbucks, I'm definitely going to be getting a coffee. Ooh. Mmm. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Hey. What am I doing? I don't know. This is really good. I didn't go to the gym today, so this is going to be great. Is there anything that I'm not gonna like? This is insane. This one, I'm gonna give this one a 10 out of 10 too. This is so good. I don't wanna drink the rest of it just because these are so bad for you, but like, I'm probably gonna. This is the last drink that we have. This is the pumpkin chai tea latte. We'll take the little stopper knopper out. Hey, right, let's take a sip. Mm. Mm. I can't tell if I like this. Like, I feel like I like it, but then again, I'm like, do I like it? This one is super sweet. I don't know if I would get this one again. No, not for me. Nope, I'm gonna give that one like a five. It's not bad, it's not the worst thing that I've ever tasted, but it's definitely not the best. I feel like it's just a little bit too sweet for me. The other three are definitely my favorites. In order from first to last, I would do pumpkin spice latte, 
the cold cream, cold cream, cold brew. What am I talking about? Pumpkin cream, cold brew, frappuccino. And then in last place is the pumpkin chai tea latte. I put the frappuccino third because it's like the least likely thing that I would get. It is really good. Now moving on to the treats. I only got two treats. I know they had three, but my Starbucks was sold out of the pumpkin cream cheese muffin, which I'm so sad about because I love anything with cream cheese in it. in this video but we do have the pumpkin scone here so this is what this one looks like i don't know if i really like scones Ooh, it's a little messy i don't know if i really like scones i've never had a scone so we're gonna see mm. it's kind of like a muffin it's like a kind of hard muffin the icing on this is so good i love icing any type of icing I'm obsessed with. I'm that person that licks the icing off of cupcakes first and then eats the cupcake. So this is delicious, I love it. I'm going to give this one a nine out of 10. It is really good. I'm gonna save some of that for my mom. The last thing that we have here are the pumpkin spice melons. So let's go ahead, give these a go. So we can open them. These look like little seashells, that's so cute. Okay. Mm. These kind of taste like pumpkin bread, but like burnt pumpkin pumpkin bread. I don't know if I like the crust of it because it kind of tastes burnt to me. I'm gonna give those like a five. They were okay, but yeah, that's everything from Starbucks. I really wish I could have got the pumpkin cream cheese muffin. I know I would have loved that, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button down below if you're not already subscribed to my channel, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. I am going to be on the toilet all day after this. This is not going to be good. <laughs>